I don't think anyone's there, honey. Come on. We'll go to that motel we passed a while back.
Okay, we need to find a way to Blackrock Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prism. Our agents discovered a light switch cord in a Butte bungalow closet. They pulled the cord and were instantly transported to the Ocean View Motel and Casino. Dream like haze. Inside, they found a door marked with an inverted black pyramid. And just like that, it led back to the oldest house, some 2,000 miles from Montana. Now we're finding the cord in increasing numbers throughout the Bureau. Somehow the two places, they became in tune to each other. The, the actual physical location of the Ocean View is, is, is a mystery. Stepping beyond its walls has so far proven impossible. A place of power, like the oldest house.
glad to see you're still you. Hey, thanks for bringing down that... whatever the fuck that was. But we are barely holding on here, boss. How's the situation outside maintenance? What do I tell him? The truth is harsh, but these people seem familiar with death. The hiss are everywhere. Most of the Bureau is lost. We need Blackrock Prism to make more HRAs for any survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling Blackrock Lab. So to recap, uh, death, disaster, and imminent destruction. Another day at the FBC. But Darling's lab is just past Blackrock Processing. Well, I got good news and I got bad news on that front. Good news is, it's right down the hall. Bad news is, a hiss monster has decided to move in, so that's great. Monster. That's what the Rangers said. The ones that survived, anyway. But we are just treading water here, and the hiss keep coming. Salvador would know what to do, but apparently he took a security team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened, and... Well, no one's seen him since. But hey, at least we got you, our fearless leader. They shouldn't rely on me. They don't know me. They don't know how I've failed people. You've done a good job here, Arish, but you should take your people and get to the base and executive. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. I'm getting kind of used to them. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me. Ranger squad Charlie 7 returned from an expedition into the quarry threshold just after 0500 Zulu. Can you please state your names and describe the purpose of your expedition? Kevin Horowitz, Rupert Well. Our mission was to map quarry grid coordinates G29. Secondary objective, as always, was to find a route from the threshold entrance and maintenance to the formation. Secondary objective was not a success. I'm not doing so hot. And did you You're fine. Previously we'll push through this. The hiss of the ones well doing the pushing, the Doc. No. Nothing. Do you think we should tell them about the mermaid? Excuse me? Yeah, the mermaid. Arish wasn't kidding about that monster. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Shit! They're shattered! Not a single prism left. Hurry up and find our new lab. There are areas in the oldest house where under the right conditions, when the frequencies match, other dimensions leak in. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's Darling's that's where key. Black Rock comes from. This, you heard that too, right? Black Rock comes from the a threshold. Quarry. So the prisms must be there too. Contained. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research 
involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock Line fire is. It's a panopticon container system. Sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need to cut the line. Oh, uh, Emily. The codes, Black Rock. Everything here is crazy. Weird, but it feels... Right, like how the world should be. I am in an infinite building leading to different dimensions and I never want to leave. Even with all the horror, I'm happy. It feels safe. Elevator's broken. Gotta get down the old-fashioned way.
what I expected. Thank <laughs> you. 
Pope wants us to compile all of Darling's data entries in the past month. Fade it. Did you find a prism? It's corrupted organism very so wildly. What's the connection? She must think he's hiding something. Hi, Jesse. I keep finding traces of Darling, but still can't find him. Where could he be? But he's usually in his office in research or one of his labs. Dr. Darling has quite a few all around the bureau. Could be hiding in any one of them. I check myself, but I don't have access to most of them. Sounds like I touched a nerve. He didn't let you into his labs? Not all of them, no. Some had volatile material. It's ridiculous. I mean, this whole place is volatile material. Could have at least thought up a more convincing lie. I mean, how can I work without access to all the data possible? This place has a bad habit of moving around, huh? So you notice the building shifts. Did you know that 39% of bureau accidents are caused by the shifts? It's true. I ran the numbers myself. So they're dangerous. Oh, very. Yet one time, a shark got shifted into a meeting room along with over 2,000 gallons of water. It was a tiger shark, Darling's pet research project. I forget what he was researching. How do people work here? You said you're an assistant? Oh, it's just a title. I'm a scientist, a researcher. I work for Dr. Darling. See, when bureau agents go out in the field, the sites of altered world events, we study the materials, the altered items they bring back. It's always something we've never seen before. And studying them requires new instruments, methodologies, sometimes entirely new fields of science. Emily really loves her job. See, there's no guidebook for what we do here. Everything that happens at the bureau, including the science, is without precedent. What exactly is the Ocean View Motel? That's a bigger question than you might think. You see, I have extreme doubts that the motel is a single place. I mean, look at all the doors inside it. Where do they all go? We know that one door leads to the oldest house, but how come we can only ever open that one door? Maybe to open a door, you have to have entered through it. So if every door leads to a different dimension, plane, reality, whatever you want to call it, then I believe that the motel is firm proof that parallel universes exist. Does Darling agree with that? I haven't told him yet. I'm waiting until I can prove it. What can you tell me about control points? They're nexus points of the oldest house's unique energies. Well, I wrote a 30-page proposal hypothesizing that we could siphon energy directly from them. Darling didn't even get through the first page before he turned it down. Right. And, uh, has anyone ever used them to teleport around? What? Uh, no. What, I mean, you mean physically? Uh, no, not that I've ever heard of. Why? Because that's how they work for me. What? Really? Oh my god. More tests. Let's... Hold off on the tests until later, okay? Okay, you know, it's just, wow. I mean, this blows my control point theories right out of the water. I love it. See you soon. Be careful out there. wants us to compile all of Darling's data entries from the past month. She wants us to crack Darling's personal logs? Who crucify us if he finds out? Who does she think she is authorizing that kind of data breach? She must Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. We will start HRA production immediately. I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. This is it. She knows. Seventeen years I've waited. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate Six, codenamed P6. We brought him here after the ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. 
He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him. We took him in. Your parents vanished along with every other adult in Ordinary. Eventually, his power changed him. There were casualties. He wasn't fit to be the director. Did you know about this? Is this why you didn't bring me here sooner? Were you keeping me away? Where is Dylan? He's kept in the containment sector, in the Panopticon. My brother... I thought we were the same. What if we are? I'm going. Now. I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the Hiss find. It shouldn't take long, but you must watch the Bureau while I'm gone. And remember, Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Faden. How do I make her stop calling me that? I'm not here for them. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies or my friends? I need to see Dylan. I need to know. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Just stay with me, okay? I could use a friend right now. <laughs>